Welcome to the World Tarot. This is going to be a reading for the 13th of October 2021 for Earth Signs. It's going to be time stamped. I'm going to do all the Earth Signs. So we're going to start with Taurus, the first Earth Sign, obviously. Holy Spirit, let's talk to me. Let's talk. I mean, talk to me about Taurus. Uh-oh. Lots of stuff happening today for Taurus. Let's see. Let's describe Taurus. It's in reverse for me. Because I'm on this side. So, Ace of Swords reverse. There's some kind of lie or something's hidden. Or maybe you're lying. I don't know. You're hiding something or someone's hiding something from you. But this is describing you because I said describe Taurus. So, what else about Taurus? Maybe you're dealing with a Libra or you could have Libra in your chart or some kind of air sign. Or maybe you're on the cusp of Taurus and Libra. Uh, not Libra, I mean Gemini. Okay, so let's see what's up with the, with the earth signs. Sorry, I mean Taurus. Why did Taurus come up as the Ace of Swords reversed? Holy Spirit, why did Taurus come up as Ace of Swords reversed? I saw the Fool, but I don't know if it flipped or not. But I definitely saw the Fool in the upright. Oh, this is the Fool, yeah. So... You might be taking a leap of faith or you might be traveling. You could secretly travel somewhere. Also, you might, like the fool with the Ace of Swords reverse, you might lie about something. What's happening here? Let's see. What's happening? Are they lying about something? What are they lying about if that's the case? Or you're doing something in secret. You could be traveling towards someone in secret or somewhere in secret. What what are uh what is Taurus doing in secret here? What is Taurus doing in secret? What is Taurus doing? Holy Spirit, what are they up to? All this stuff flipped over. <laughs> what are they up to? The fool again. <laughs> they're doing something foolish, possibly, or like they're taking a risk. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Nine of Cups. Because maybe they don't want to be single anymore. Their wish fulfillment is to have the Ten of Cups, but it's in reverse. So, I don't know. Six of Wands reversed. And the Eight of Pentacles reversed. So, something's not working. Maybe you want to go towards someone to have a victory with someone, but it won't work. I don't know. What doesn't work? Why do we have all these free cards here? Ten of Pentacles reverse, Six of Wands reverse, Eight of Pentacles reverse. What doesn't work? What won't work? What is this? Nine of Wands. What won't work? The Nine of Wands. Um, like I said, maybe you want to go towards someone, but this person's close off to you. So we have three nines here, nine, nine, nine. What is nine, nine, nine? Why do I get nine, nine, nine here? Six of Swords. Again, it talks about traveling, moving away somewhere. Six of Pentacles, reversed. Not giving to two people, not... Uh... Okay, we've got six, six, six. We've got nine, nine, nine and six, six, six. So what's happening for Taurus exactly? Are they going to be rejected or something? Is Taurus going to be rejected by someone? Three of Swords. Yes. That, that's the rejection card, Four of Cups, by the way. So someone... Maybe you broke this person's heart in the past and they, that's why they'll reject you. I don't know. Or this person's trying to avoid the heartbreak with the Nine of Wands. This person's kind of like the Nine of Wands. It's very defensive. Three of Swords reversed. And like I think this person moved away on purpose from you. Because like I said, I feel like you have to go towards this person. Maybe you need to travel towards this person or something. And, um, but this, because this person has moved away physically. And I don't think this, yeah, this person is definitely going to reject you. Because I, I asked about rejection, I got the rejection card. Okay, so, um, is there anything you can do to make amends with this person? Holy Spirit, is there anything that Taurus can do to make amends with this person? Three of Wands. Uh, they need to take it slow. They need to wait for their for something. 
Maybe they need to wait for this person to come back. I don't know. Five of Swords reversed. Okay, so maybe you, you've been, like I said, you could have hurt this person a lot in the past. You could have been cruel to them. Maybe you put them in a third party situation in the past, actually. Two of Swords reversed. Maybe you need to admit certain things to this person. And you need to stop um, you need to stop hurting this person anymore. I don't know what else you can do. What else can they do in order to um, Ace of Wands? You do need to take some kind of action though. What kind of action do they need to take? The Knight of Swords was there, but um, I don't know when it flipped. Okay, so the King of Swords came. I had the Knight of Swords flipped in the in the deck, and now the King of Swords came. You need to tell the truth, like be very honest, like tell everything that you've done wrong, and admit your mistakes, and be fair, and all that stuff. And that's how you can have a new beginning with this person. Um, will this person actually take you back if you do the right thing? It's like do the right thing, right? Okay, so what's the right thing? You know better than me. What's the right thing for Taurus? I've got so much air in this reading of oh, fire people. Actually, everything. I don't know. Okay, so um, maybe you're dealing with an air sign, like I said. This king of swords could be the other person. They could be very closed off towards you. But that's why you need to be as... You need to come correct towards this person, basically. Give them justice somehow. I don't know what that means to you. You know better. Okay, Taurus, what else... What else about Taurus? What else does Taurus need to know about this person? Five of Wands. Uh, this person might argue with you. They might... Um, you should be ready for this person maybe to argue with you or something. King of Pentacles. So, if... If the other person tries to start some kind of argument or something, you need to stand your ground and you need to, to be calm and patient. You, you need to, to be very in a very leader kind of position, like act like a leader, but like a positive leader who, you know, who knows how to... It's like strong, silent type here with the King of Pentacles, and that's very appropriate for Taurus, so there you go. You need to calm them down. If they try to start an argument or something, calm them down. Okay, what else? King of Wands. Okay, so all these kings. You have three kings here. So you need to embody like emperor energy. You need to be very, um, very serious and very measured, you know. To, to, to give this person, to let this person know that they can trust you. Because they don't trust you, because you've hurt them in the past. So you need to prove that you are trustworthy, I guess. Anything else for Taurus? No, because it's in reverse. The Ace of Cups is in reverse. Four of Pentacles, hold back. That's all. Also, this is Taurus, isn't it? Emperor, right? Mini Emperor. So yeah, you need to act like an Emperor. And make a choice. Okay, so there you go. That's the reading for Taurus. Let's move to Virgo now. Let's see what's uh, what's happening for Virgo today. Holy Spirit, show me Virgo. Show me Virgo. What's happening for Virgo today on the 13th of October 2021? Show me Virgo. The Virgo Collective. Show me the Virgo Collective. Show me Virgo, please. What's happening for Virgo? Six of Pentacles is Virgo. But Virgo is in reverse for some reason. Maybe they don't have Pentacles or something. Or they've been given too much and they don't want to give anymore. They, they could be burdened by something. It could be financial difficulties. Or maybe they, they've been over giving and people have been putting their energy on them too much. And... Um, Six of Wands, though. Look at that. They're going to have a victory. What kind of victory is Virgo going to have today? Six of Cups. Oh my god, 666 six, six already here. Whoa. The victory could be regarding um, 
a child or a love offer. Is there a child here? Queen of Cups reversed. Uh, no, I don't think so. Queen of Cups reversed is like not a mother. So there's no mother. So there is no child if there's no mother, I guess. Okay. There you go. So what's happening here for Virgo? Or their inner child. They need to repair in their inner child because they had a bad mother. Okay, we're getting in too deep already. <laughs> okay, so what's happening here? What's... Um, What's the victory? Maybe they'll have a victory over some kind of childhood wounds today. Knight of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles is a child. So, yeah. They they are working on themselves. They could be working on themselves today a lot to heal some kind of issues. Okay. For, yeah, healing. Yes, okay, yeah, they're healing. There you go. It's happening and they'll have a victory over this healing. Yay, Virgo. Okay, what else for Virgo today? What else should Virgo know? Anything about love? I didn't ask for anyone else if there's anything about love. Now I ask for love for Virgo. Shame on me. No, there's nothing about love. <laughs> no, Ace of Pentacles reversed. <laughs> okay, sorry, Virgo. <laughs> okay. Okay, anything else that Virgo needs to know today? Knight of Wands reversed. Uh oh, there might be a player coming towards you. Or something. The Fool reversed. Okay, someone might do something foolish. Yeah, you might have... Uh, this could be like a player alert. There's no love, but there's a player. Okay, who's the player, please? Everything wants to come out in reverse. Nine of Swords reversed. Someone you no longer think about, I think. Is, is you're not concerned about this is not someone you think about or anything like that so what does this player want from Virgo seven of pentacles reversed they want to reap uh, some kind of benefits <laughs> or maybe uh, yeah I don't know what exactly does the player want with Virgo nine of wands reversed and the Queen of Wands, okay, they want sex. Obviously, what can they want? Okay. So they, they hope that Virgo will put their guard down so they can have sex with them. Okay, so what should Virgo, how should Virgo handle this person? If they come towards Virgo. How should Virgo handle this person? Ten of Cups reverse. Don't give them anything. Don't think that they want a yeah, don't don't give them any energy. It's like it's not gonna you're not gonna have the big happy family with this person, so just don't give them anything. Two of Cups. What's the two of cups though? So okay, there's an oh you have other options. Ah, you know what? A, a better option might be coming in for you actually with the two of cups here and the seven of cups. You have many options. And a better one, a much healthier option come, is coming towards you. So that's why you shouldn't, uh, you shouldn't give this person anything here with the Ten of Cups reversed. Okay, I got it. So it's not coming right now, but there's something coming soon that's better than this, I guess. Okay. So let's describe the new person that's coming towards you. Can we see the person that's coming towards Virgo, the Two of Cups person, not the Knight of Wands reverse person? Can we see the Two of Cups person? Who is the Two of Cups person here? Holy Spirit, who is this Two of Cups coming towards Virgo? It's a wish fulfillment. It's someone who doesn't cause you heartache or pain. Okay? Someone who's not going to be gaslighting you. Yeah, wow. You're getting your wish fulfillment. You're getting someone who's independent, who's happy, who's not going to be like... Who's not a narcissist, <laughs> Two of Wands reversed, Five of Cups, Six of Swords, and the King of Wands reversed. So first you need to move away. Uh, you need to move away from uh, sorrow and pain and this person from King of Wands, Knight of Wands reversed. So you need to leave that behind first so you can have the new, yeah, Two of Wands reversed. You need to stop dealing with this possible fire sign person. So you can have, yeah, Knight of Swords reversed. What's the Knight of Swords reversed? 
two of pentacles reversed this person could also have some kind of mental issues they're kind of off their rocker with the knight of swords reversed and the two of pentacles reversed and the king of wands reversed could be someone who's not just a player but they could be aggressive they could be foolish they could be impulsive so yeah you need to get away from this person don't let this person come back because i don't think you're with this person two of swords reversed I think the blindfold came off already. Two, two, two could be significant. And another two. All the twos are here. Yes. Okay. So you know what it's what you know what I'm talking about. You already know who this is, who you're dealing with. So three of cups reverse. There's no reunion with this person. Yeah. So Virgo knows already what's happening here and they're healing themselves. So good good for Virgo. Virgo is good at doing that. So there you go. The healer of the zodiac. Yes, I'm I'm bragging because I'm a virgin. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, let's uh, go to Capricorn. Holy Spirit, show me Capricorn today. Holy Spirit, show me Capricorn today. Holy Spirit, show me Capricorn today. Six of Wands. It's in the upright, but I just pushed it in reverse by mistake. <laughs> Capricorn is going to have some kind of victory today. They could be in the public eye or whatever. It could be a small victory or a big victory. I don't know. Two of Pentacles reversed. But there's some kind of imbalance here. Maybe they're having a victory over something that was uh, that does, didn't look fair. Yes. So maybe uh, the, the, the odds were against you. I've been stuttering all day today. Oh my god. It's those energies that I keep getting on the channel. Okay, so Capricorn's gonna have a victory over something that wasn't fair, that was imbalanced, okay, today. So what is this? What kind of victory is this? Let's talk more about, yes. So there's a new beginning, there's a, a new passion sparking up. This could talk about you becoming kind of famous or something, I don't know. Yes. You could become famous for something, or at least well-known. Maybe for your intellect. Talk to me more about Capricorn today. What's happening for Capricorn today? Queen of Pentacles reversed. You might be... Okay, so you might be leaving. Okay, this could be a divorce from someone who... Um, from a relationship where you weren't happy. And this might be your victory. It might be a smaller victory. It might be a bigger big victory. Nine of Cups. You're going to feel fulfilled once you leave this person behind. So you're going to feel more fulfilled without this person than with the person. Okay? There you go. What else should Capricorn... What, did, what other messages do we have for Capricorn for today? Four of Cups. You're going to reject this person, basically. Or if this person's trying to come back towards you. I'm not sure if you're in a relationship still with this person or not. But you're going to reject an, a love offer. Okay. Someone, okay. This could be someone who oversteps your boundaries, doesn't respect your boundaries. Someone who could be love bombing you. Okay, so what's going to happen today? This could be another person, actually, because you might be in a relationship with someone and you want to leave that person behind. And also there's someone who's love bombing you at the same time, another person. Not necessary. But you're going to reject everyone because you've learned that people who overstep your boundaries are not good for you. There's no healing with these people, okay? so, And you're not going to sleep with this person if that's what they want with the Four of Swords reversed. Six of Cups reversed. This could be someone from your past that you have bad memories with, whether it's the same person or not, because it's not clear if the Knight of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles reverse are the same person. They could be two different people that you're dealing with. This could be someone you're currently with and you want to leave them, and this could be someone from the past who wants to come back towards you, but you don't want them either. So you might just want to be single. Yes, exactly. Queen of Swords. You want to cut everyone out, all the old people. Good idea. It's always a good idea. Anything else for Capricorn for today? Anything else for Capricorn? You don't want any heartbreak. You don't want third parties. You, you don't want anyone. 
you just want to be to yourself for now. Anything else for Capricorn for today? Three of Wands reversed. Um, you're no longer waiting for anything. It's like you're happy by yourself, I guess. You're no longer waiting for unions or for love or for marriage or for anything like that. Eight of Wands reversed, King of Wands reversed. Yeah. It's like you're not even interested in sex anymore. It's like you're fed up with everyone. <laughs> okay. Ten of Pentacles. Maybe you're just uh, focused on your legacy, on your finances. Six of Souls reversed. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Seven, seven could talk about karma here. Ten of Swords. Oh, big, a big painful ending. So... You, you could have had some karmic relationships that are ending now. And that's it. Like it's the end of all these karmic relationships. So good for you then. Three of Pentacles reversed. Yeah. Leaving third parties behind and everything. And the family and everything like that. King of Cups. And you're going to feel more happy, more fulfilled by yourself. You're loving yourself first. Okay. You're taking care of yourself. All the kings are here. All the kings are here. But this one's in the reverse. Maybe you need to focus more on financial abundance or something. Nine of Swords. There's some kind of anxiety over money, I think. So you're going to focus more on your money than anything else right now. Wait, because I missed all my cards. So how are they going to get out of this financial difficulty? How can Capricorn get out of financial difficulty? Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Stop giving money to others, I guess. I don't know. Ten of Cups reverse. Get out of... Uh, maybe the, the, the partner is draining you financially. I don't know. Six of Pentacles reverse. Stop giving to multiple people. Eight of Swords. What's the Eight of Swords? Holy Spirit, why is the Eight of Swords here for Capricorn? Why is the Eight of Swords the advice? What? Knight of Swords. You need... Oh, this could be troubles with the police, actually. With the law. Are there any problems with the law, law for Capricorn? Yes, wow. Yes, there are. Eight of Cups reversed. There could be... What's that? What kind of uh, police matters are these what's happening here what has capricorn done bum, bum, bum. what what's happening for capricorn why is the police ca coming after capricorn holy spirit two of swords reversed because something came to light the police found out something about capricorn what did capricorn do holy spirit what did capricorn do what did capricorn do Knight of Pentacles, something about money, you took some money or you kept money that you shouldn't have kept, I don't know. Seven of Cups reversed, Five of Cups. I don't know. Maybe you have to pay, I was thinking about paying money for a child, like uh, for child support maybe. And I got this. This is kind of like a yes for me. And the, the fool is also a child. So I think maybe this has to do with child support. Someone could be taking it to court for child support. Nine of Wands. Or even even they might say that you hurt the child or something. Or you, you're going to defend yourself. You'll have to defend yourself in court. Did Capricorn hurt the child or is it just financial stuff here? Five of Wands reversed. No, you didn't hurt the child physically. Four of Wands. This is a, like a family matter. It's like if this person that you're leaving, they will want... Uh, maybe they'll take you to court because they need um, money for the child. And that's what will cause you financial issues. Yeah. So that's the thing here. 
Yes. Okay, so that it's clear now. Okay, so that's uh, that's the reading for the earth signs for today. This was Capricorn. I hope this helps. Take care. Bye.